When it comes to celebrity assets, the golden rule seems to be the bigger the better. The more you like a super yacht, the more important you're famous. The more unique a private jet, the larger the collection of cars and the higher the price of the villa. All of this contributes to the image and charm of a celebrity. Riding Johnny Depp's former super fancy pirate themed $30 million yacht, that may be true for most social celebrities, but Johnny Depp was by no means your usual celebrity. As Hollywood's highest paying star, he was well worth over $900 million at the height of his career. But since then, that amount has dropped to $100 million up to $150 million. His financial turmoil is due to many factors, most notably the failure to marry Amber Heard, allegations of domestic violence against him, and wine alone spending about $500,000 a month, his unlimited lifestyle including that. Back while he changed into nevertheless Disney's favorite pirate and the final heartthrob, Johnny Depp changed into additionally the proprietor of one of the maximum well-known celebrity-owned boats, frequently defined as an aggregate among Gypsy Caravan, Art Deco Luxurious Hotel, and the fanciest non-public railway car. The motor yacht wasn't well known as it changed into big or full of outrageous amenities, or for that matter, eye-watering expensive. It changed into well known as it changed into his, and as it changed into the entirety you'd photograph a Johnny Depp boat could be. Vahali Roja is now not in Depp's portfolio of assets due to the fact that the actor changed into pressure to promote in the 2016 after numerous conferences together along with his advisors and the belief that he had to liquidate to keep away from bankruptcy. The selection changed into very taxing for the actor as it emerged within some of the ongoing Depp vs. Her defamation lawsuit. Knowing a few contexts, approximately the motor yacht makes his disappointment at having to component with it extra understandable. Vahali Roja is an older motor yacht, brought via way of means of Protexan turquoise yachts on fee in 2001. It has a metal hull, aluminium GRP teak superstructure and clean 1920 steampunk vibes. Until Depp sold it, it sailed below the Anatolia name, and it had already been available in the marketplace for some time while the actor determined he desired to put money into a yacht. Whereas maximum celebrities will need something new, Depp seemed at the used market, due to the fact he desired something with personality. Anatolia stuck his sight, however, changed into first of all deemed too small. At 156 feet, 47.5 meters, three decks and lodging for 10 visitors and nine crew, it changed into that due to the fact he compared it to the long variety explorers he'd been searching at. An explorer though has the entirety however personality, so Depp ended up shopping for Anatolia sight unseen for an undisclosed amount. Upon purchase, Anatolia got here with naval structure via way of means of Tanju, Kalasioglu, and indoor styling via way of means of Redman Whiteley. The latter changed into ripped out in a primary 2007 refit and changed via way of means of a layout via way of means of L.M. Pagano, operating in near collaboration with Depp himself. The boat changed into technically Depp's in pass due 2006. However, it changed into prepared for cruising with inside the summertime season of 2007, now with a lavish pirate themed indoors and a brand new name, Vajo Liroja which stands for the primary letters with inside the names of the own circle of relatives members Vanessa, Johnny, Lily Rose, and Jack. The refit supposedly fee over $7 million, with a suggested overall fee for the boat at a few $30 million. After Deb's wedding ceremony to Amber Heard, it changed into renamed Amphitrite, goddess of the ocean and Poseidon's spouse in Greek mythology. In early 2016, after visiting it and falling in love with the indoors, Harry Potter creator J.K. Rowling sold it for a suggested $24 million or $28.9 million. Less than 12 months later, she indexed it for a touch over $19 million. So anything infatuated, she must have felt with it dissipated fast and at a fee. The current owner is unknown, but he is believed to be a businessman. The boat is currently sailing under the name Arriva with only the owner. As far as we know, the interior of Pagano, which leaves this boat a unique personality, still remains. Highlights include crumpled Italian velvet, silk, 
jacquard, especially oxidized patterned leather, antiques from around the world, luxurious chenille walls, hand-painted feather trim, and 24-carat gold fixtures as furniture accents, including luxurious materials such as, at first glance, there is too much styling. Not only is it overwhelming, but it's also totally stuffy. A few years ago, in the only interview with the print version of Boat International, Pagano stated that Depp himself was directly involved in the design and the results were surprisingly successful. In addition, the boat was a cool and comfortable hanging. Each cabin is a private bathroom with rich decor and custom details to make up for the lack of additional space. For example, each cabin has its own custom stationery with old pirate fonts commissioned by Depp. No matter what you read online, the former Vaholi Roja does not have a helipad pool or hot tub, but it does have a large protected stern dining area and a cozy sun deck. Facilities also include an indoor dining room, a private cinema, and a range of water toys, including a bespoke Reva-style bid to sit on the bow. With two upgraded Caterpillar diesel engines, the X Vaholi Roja reaches a top speed of 13.5 knots, 15.5 miles per hour, or 25 kilometers per hour, and boasts a cruising range of 2,300 nautical miles, 2,647 miles, or 4,269 kilometers. Increase. During Depp's ownership period, it was often offered for charters at an average weekly $130,000. In fact, Rowling was so excited to sail it and liked it so much that he bought it. 